What you fixing DIYers? It's Walker with DIY.life. And in this episode, we are gonna be checking out this awesomely big toolkit from iFixit. Oh. So here's the box iFixit sent me. It's actually got some decent weight to it. And if you look, it says on here, do not open with sharp object. Sounds like a, sounds like a challenge to me. Hmm. Ooh. Okay, well I think I have a screwdriver here. I'll be extra careful with. Hopefully won't cut anything. And I've got an iFixit t-shirt. They were cool enough to uh, throw in a free t-shirt for me to rep while I'm making my videos. What the heck is this? It's a bandana. This is for you and Remy. Oh, that's nice. Remy, look, they made you a bandana. And it's got the iFixit logo, but it's, it's got a bone instead of a wrench. That is super cute. Remy, come here. Let's put this on you. Yeah, buddy, you're my Fixit co-pilot. You need the gear. Let's get you, let's get this bandana put on you. Nice. Oh, you look so good. Put the shirt on. If you do find yourself in Carl's bed and you're hungry, I would uh, go check out Gonzo Ramen Shop. They're fantastic. All right, what do you think? Hey, Remy, you like it? Look good? All right, now it's official. Fits pretty good. So here we have the tool kit. Ooh, it is big. It's a lot bigger than I thought. And we got some iFixit stickers. Those are always fun. Ooh, it's in a nice case. Mm. Ah, this is the pledge. You know, one of the cool things about this company, and I, um, I discovered iFixit back in, I think it was like 2020, 2019. Uh, my iPhone 6 battery was starting to die, couldn't hold a charge all day. So I found their battery replacement kit, picked that up, watched the video online that they provided, and boom, new battery. And I got another four years out of that iPhone. I just retired it like last year. So, and one of the cool things I remember when I was, um, you know, when I received the battery kit was that they, they give you all this stuff and they have this thing called the pledge and it's fun. It's like, oh, it's called the, manif the manifesto, the repair manifesto. And it basically talks about um, making things more repairable. And one of the really cool things about this company is not only do they have great products and they provide lots of free materials, lots of free repair guides, um, tools, batteries, screens, what have you, parts, pieces, but they also have an advocacy component to their company where they are in Washington and they're pushing tech companies to make products that are more repairable because when a product is more repairable, it's not throwaway and it's not trash and it's not e-waste. So this is the sustainability thing and I re was really impressed by how, how, um, how cool that was with all the things that they give you. And I remember thinking, wow, this is, this is like a really cool company. I wanna, I wanna get more involved with this company. And then fast forward, you know, four or five years later, uh, they reached out to me and they're like, hey, we've been watching some of your videos and we think that 
you need some legit tools <laughs> to do your uh, DIY stuff. So uh, can we send you some legit tools? So that became a partnership and now I'm a ambassador for iFixit. And so over the next few uh, weeks and months here, I'm gonna be creating a series of iFixit videos in tandem with them. And um, we're gonna be fixing some cool stuff. We're gonna be using these tools and checking everything out and see how it all works. And uh, hopefully inspire you to fix something of your own. So yeah, look at this. It's got, ooh, a caliper, digital caliper. Fantastic. Protec Toolkit. Looks like this has like different lifters and tweezers and all kinds of drill bits. Mmm. It's like Christmas. And these are um, suction cups for, for glass on uh, phone screens, lifting up the, uh, the screens. And we got some glass cleaner. Ooh. Anti-clamp device opener. All right, yeah, this thing uh, pulls things apart. So you helps you pull the, the glass off the iPhone. Mm -hmm. Magnetizer, demagnetizer, that could be interesting. And then you get all of these little, these little pry tools, they're great. And we got a work mat. And this work mat has little trays for all the screws, all the little itty bitty screws. When you take all the screws out and stuff, those things want to just fly and get away from you. Well, this thing has little trays built into it, so everything stays put right on the mat. It's fantastic. Got a little air blower. We got a brush, we got more pry tools in here. And a microfiber cloth. Let's see what's in this pocket. Ooh, here's where all the here's where all the drivers are. That looks to be some kind of a proprietary driver. All of these things have little illustrations on them that show what shape they are. Because there's all different kinds of screws and proprietary components that they provide everything for. This looks to be a voltometer, possibly. Yep. And an anti-static mat. That's great. Wow. I am super impressed. This is a lot of stuff. Okay, I know I say duct tape and zip ties can fix just about anything, but in reality, this can fix just about anything. You gotta get yourself some nice tools to get your work done, and this is a nice set of tools for sure. I am definitely gonna be putting this thing to good use, and over the next month or two, we're gonna watch, we're gonna do some videos together and I'm gonna show you just how great these tools are. So, stay tuned. Look forward to these uh, Fix-It videos coming out. We got, a, we got a bunch of cool ones coming up. In fact, the first one I'm gonna do, I think I brought it here. The first video I'm gonna do is fix this gimbal I got. I got this Zeeyun, I think that's how you say it, Zeeyun gimbal for a phone or a small camera and it worked for maybe six or eight months and then the battery stopped charging. So I'm going to go in here. I've got uh, new batteries, rechargeable batteries for this thing and we're going to pull them out, get them soldered in there and put it back to work. So that'll be one of my first projects. Stay tuned for that video and when it's done, it'll be here. Once again, I'd like to thank iFixit for sending me all these goodies. I am really excited to start putting this toolkit to use. And if you're as excited as I am, uh, put a comment down below. And the first one to uh, tell me my co-pilot's name can get a uh, free iFixit vinyl sticker. Put it down there. If you have any questions or comments about the iFixit toolkit, please leave them below. If you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. And we, well, we'll see you next time.